Oh, leader of the opposition. Well, I was for it. I had said so myself that you should, he should become the leader of the opposition. You know, I've been leader of opposition. I've also been the chief minister. And I think you learn much more when you're leader of the opposition. Uh, the chief minister, there's a team there for, to give you everything. You have your staff there. You have every information coming in here. You've got to collect everything like I've been doing since yesterday for tomorrow's speech. So, you know, you have to do it yourself. And I think he would have learnt more if he had, had he come into that. So why, but why, is he, why didn't he come? I don't know. I've never asked him. But I think uh, he should have taken it on. No, I don't think he's running away from responsibility. I think, you know, he's... Look, I've been 47 years in the game. I also started young at that age. And you always have uh, uh, doubts. You have various, various uh, ways you uh, think of uh, situations at that stage. And gradually, gradually you learn. He will learn too. And it's, only, it's not a question of running away from a responsibility. He probably feels that it's better for him to work outside to develop the party. That's what I feel is his reasoning. I tried my best at that stage to tell him, please do not do these elections. I told, spoke to the Congress president. She spoke to him also. But he had his mindset that we have put, a, put something in, in force, in place, and it's moving, and I don't want to interfere in that. I told him that if you, uh, this is I think pre-1912, to, uh, pre uh, 2012, and I said, you know what will happen? You, you will divide each village. Because each village will have youth congress groups and then once say, they are divided in the, in the youth congress, then they get divided at the top. Their parents also take sides like that. And I said, we'll have a problem. He wouldn't listen and eventually that is what happened. I, no, no, I think, you know, he has his ideas. Um, his father was president of the youth congress and the general secretary when I was with him also then. He had his own ideas. Sanjay Gandhi had his own ideas. So everyone has his own idea of how things should be fixed. And uh, he took it upon himself and I did tell him, but uh, then, you know, one, once your mind is made up, then it's very difficult to change. Firstly, I don't think that Modi, with the promises he's made, can keep them. I think one should just go through them. I was going through them today to see his... It's impossible. Can you create, he says, till by 1975, every home in the whole country will have a, a toilet, a bath, a, a television, or whatever else he said. So can he do it? In, by, in, in eight years' time, by 19, in our 70, 75th anniversary. Can he make 100 towns in the next uh, five years? I mean, these are absurd things to say. Eventually, I think we will have, it will be how the BJP functions as a government. And uh, as I was just saying, I don't expect them to really perform because of the uh, resource constraints. And uh, also, uh, more than that, their um, uh, promises, I think there are too many promises. That's, that's something that I don't think anyone can do. That is the primary thing. I think it'll, then you have to wait and see how it, it works out. You know, she has her own, um, uh, let's say, um, ability and so does Rahul have his own, uh, his own. And I think together they can make a very good team to help the Congress President along. And I think she's, uh, I've, I've known these children from when they were, well, I shouldn't say children, but I, since they were children, because they studied with my, my uh, daughter and son, Priyanka was my daughter and he was my son. So we used to see, meet each other often in Dehradun and all that. So I um, know her, she's a very uh, determined young lady. And uh, Rahul, in, in, incidentally, was a very inquisitive little boy. He wanted to know everything what was happening. And, you know, I thought that's a very good sign. Uh, it makes a, it's a really, really a good thing. And similarly, Priyanka was very determined. And you saw her, the way she behaved, for instance, when her father's uh, grandmother died, then when her father died, and, and she was... Um, uh, I think she'd make a very good um, person for our party. And jointly, they would make a good sub-team. That's what I think.